Hello there, fellas out there. Have a good April Fool's Day because today I'm not going to fool you guys. I mean, I'm literally not going to fool you. This is a way how to play Pokemon on your Mac or Windows computer or Linux or a Raspberry Pi even because that runs Linux. And all you need is a ROM file that I'll have in the description down below and tell you this is not an April Fool's joke. And all you have to do is download this file in the link description below. And you should open up your applications folder on your Mac if you have a Mac. And you should get something like this. So right, that's your applications folder. Should be pretty simple, it's easy one, two, three. Then you just want to right click on it if it doesn't work. But if it does work, you double click on it. it should say open. If it doesn't open like I just did there, right click on it and do it again. By pressing right click and open as that. That should make it run. If that doesn't run, it should open up terminal again. It should show this thing for some weird reason. I know who why that came up, but it says PokeMMO in it. So I think that must be a good design. Close that. Alright, no, minimize it. And you'll see a Java thing come up. When that Java thing comes up, it's going to tell you it's installing updates. This might take some time. I tell you, this is no virus. Just download an image just for battles. Go get a coffee because this might take some time. Okay, now it's done. Now it says please restart the client. Okay, so I press okay. And you're like, wait, it restarts by itself though. And here's the game. Let me just put down the volume so you guys don't hear the music. Wait, hold up. It says client language. English. Of course we're English. Unless you're some of these languages. But I like to be English because I'm English. Black and white wrong. Ooh, this looks nice. But it's required. So press that. And search for your file inside of your users and then your username here. So what I'm gonna do is actually go down to my desktop and find that game. So I actually exported it to my desktop. It should be like a folder. Files two. Pokemon Black. I'm gonna do Pokemon Black. So I press okay right there and it says it's been selected fire red rom it's not necessary but i'm still going to do it so i'll go up one or if i remember how you go up here and then you go to files these are in the description down below as well you go to here press ok emerald press emerald and then ok and then hark on so silver just press so silver and then ok now it's going to say open ROMs folder. It should say something like this. A ROMs folder. If it doesn't show up any ROMs, just drag them all in here. So the way you drag them in there is you go to your, de go to your desktop again where you drag those files. You want to drag these into the ROM folder. But I don't recommend really dragging them. I recommend copying them and pasting here so you don't lose the progress of where the files files are and then you want to go into files 2 and drag black or white either one that you're using copy and paste i know i'm on an older firmware of mac os but this doesn't interfere with anything but what this is is pokey mmo what pokey mmo is is that it's a rom hack that has been updated since 2017 to 2018 and it's been going on for a crazy a long time. You first need to register and then sign in. It's very easy to register. If you just repair client, it will actually load. So I press repair. It'll reopen. It will say repair and then you just want to close Java as quickly as possible. And close terminal as quickly as possible. And pinch it with four fingers so you get that thing, or you can just go back down to your applications folder. 
and it'll open up Pokemon Mo one more time. As you can see, it crashed again, and then it opens straight away to the game, where you can log in. It says loading, and you're logged in. See? So now you can sign in. It's really cool. I don't want white, though. What do you want to change? So what you have to do is go back into close, and if you want to edit those files, it's very simple. Click on Finder, go to your Pokemon Mo folder. Like for example, you get mixed up with which Pokemon you want because I want Pokemon White, even though it does have the Pokemon Black, Pokemon and Pokemon White. It's weird. So you go to Show Back as Contents, Contents, and then Resources. See, there's nothing there. So what you want to do is go to Mac OS. Still nothing there. You're like, how do you get the files then? Oh, it's very weird. You have to go down to Library. Go to um. Application support and then Pokey MMO. You should see a folder called ROMs. Delete the Pokemon Black or just move to trash and then get downloads or whatever where your download folder was. Open up a new finder window and go back to your desktop and go to Files 2. Or wait, it's Files 1. Nope, Files 2. And do Pokemon White and just drag that into there. So I'm going to copy that and paste. Eh, misplaced that. Now close files too. And it should be copying over right now. And there you go. Now you have all your ROMs in the ROMs folder. Now open up Hokey MMO one more time. If it doesn't want to load, just drag it down to here. But I don't really open. I recommend dragging it down here because then you can actually see two different Javas and then that. So yeah. And there you go. You got the right Pokemon. You sign in. If it doesn't like sign in properly, just sign in with whatever you have. Let me see if I even remember this. Nope. Okay, so it's asking me for a scary code. If you get an email, just do proper stuff. So I'll go back to my email. I'm going to change this so you guys don't get my security code. And yeah, that's how you play the game. Bye.